Hello and welcome back to our Papal State campaign in EU4 Emperor Edition. Armies return to Rome, let's get them drilling again. And at the moment, our, uh, our arm professional is at 18%, it's not too terrible. And uh, at the moment we could also get an extra 4,000 manpower. Uh, it's not a lot, is it? It's really not a lot. I need to improve the, uh, the size of my country to get that a bit higher. Uh, can't get claimed there, I think I need 40 now. Uh, no, 35 for Venice, 40 for Naples. But yeah, uh, we're not doing too badly. Uh, 1520, we'll be able to go to war with Naples. Unfortunately, he's found my fucking spy, the bastard. Uh, um, we can go to war with Venice anytime, but I do want to uh, get this first. Mantua wants to sell me eh, 266 to make it go a bit faster. I'm okay with that, that's fine. Um, so yeah. Just Venice, and then we can probably go to war with him. However, he is allied with the Knights, and our mission that we're trying to complete means we want to stay friendly with the Knights. At least until this fort is finished, of course, which is done in, uh, you know, it's about right right now. Yeah. Uh, which means support the orders has been completed, plus 20 army tradition. Very nice. Now, Eastern Alliances. What do I need for this? I need to be allied or the overlord of any Christian country in the Balkans, Anatolia, or Caucasia regions. Let's be fair, there's only really one of those. Uh, actually, Georgia would work as well. But they don't want an alliance. Um, Caucasia, Georgia, or what was the other region? Balkans, wasn't it? Anatolia or Caucasia? Well, I mean, Ragus is really the only option here. That means Eastern Alliances has been completed. I get sailors, manpower, and 100 military points. It seems fairly reasonable. Sure. Uh, those extra 100 military points means that my ships are now more durable as well. Very, very nice. Um, however, I will say, Ragusa, I, I did it for a mission. And uh, we're, we're going to be breaking this. Like right now, because I don't want to take so many extra relations. So, um, bye bye. <laughs> uh, well, that's done. Uh, right, so what is next? Prester John, I believe. So I need to be friends with a Christian country in the Horn of Africa. Uh, sorry, I need a hundred opinion of them. Um, or I need to own six provinces in the Horn of Africa. That's all the way down here. Uh, Mercuria is Muslim. Uh, Dongola is Muslim, so I don't know. Uh, I'm gonna actually have to get down there first, and that's probably not gonna happen for a little while. Uh, I don't believe I can steal maps just yet. Maybe I can actually. When do you get the ability to steal maps? Uh, steal maps was level six. Okay, let's uh, fabricate on the Mamluks. Try and get fifty. Um, spy network, and then we can steal maps of the Horn of Africa. We'll see if we can find any uh, countries there to improve relations with. Um, there might be a Christian nation down there. I don't even know. I know that there's... I believe there's a Coptic nation. Uh, it starts as Coptic. Maybe. Um, I actually don't remember. It's been a while since I played in that region. Uh, but we're gonna have, we're gonna have to have a look, aren't we? Uh, turned in 13 ducats to embrace the institution. I feel like we can definitely wait until at least these three are all, um, all embraced. Um, Ferend and Sienna are done. Only Arezzo left to go. Arezzo's currently at oh, plus 256 a month. It's very nice. I'll take that for sure. Um, Venice also found my bloody spy, so I can't get a claim on Venice itself. What I could do, though, is go to war and take Verona, Padova, and Treviso, ignoring Venice for right this second. Might be um, a good idea, actually. Uh, let's... Do I want to do that? Do I want to do that? What are the arguments for it? More land. What are the arguments against it? Uh, he would call in his friends, which is Trent... And the knights don't really care about that. Trent is in the region of Tyrol. I could give that to Austria. Austria does not desire Treviso. They don't obviously desire Trent either. I'm going to say I want this land. 
And, I mean, Austria does have quite a few relations with us. I think this is a good idea. Let's make aggressive expansion right now. Uh, fuck all. Yeah, no, this is, this is a great idea. We've got eight years until we want to go to war with Naples, so... I see no reason not to. I see absolutely no reason not to. Let's get my morale up. And then I believe we should probably just go to war. These coastal defenses, they're cool and all. I just, I just don't see them being worth it. The, the price, totally fine on the price. The problem with taking it is you're taking up a building slot that can be used elsewhere. Why does CN have it? Eventually that will go away, but I don't need to get rid of it right now. Um, but you're taking up a precious building slot that can be used for a workshop or a temple or a marketplace or anything. There's so many different things that you could use it for. Uh, do I want a St. Peter's Basilica for until the end of my Pope's life? No, because Popes are generally quite old. Uh, like right now, 59 years old. Uh, 25 of each monarch point seems like a much better investment, honestly. Yeah, let's go to war with Venice. Um, Fleet-wise, I believe their fleet just got fucking trashed by the Ottomans, so I shouldn't have too many problems there. Fucking hate this one. This mission is, is garbage. Uh, I'll just lose a stab. And we will regain the stab. Kind of annoying. But, yeah, what can you do? Right, my morale is up to full, so we will declare the war. Austria will join me if uh, if they want to. Trent will not join Venice, so that's good. That's good. Uh, yeah, let's take Padova. Uh, Padova, the objective is for Lucca, and here the objective is for Mantua, and we're going to go and siege Treviso. They've got seven ships, uh, of which five of them are galleys, two of them are transports. But definitely we're going to be able to beat them. You may have a jubilee, that's fine. The knights had a transport, which is now at the bottom of the Mediterranean Ocean. Sea, even? It's a sea. Whatever. Close enough. Uh, so yeah, this is not going to be a very difficult war at all. Treviso needs six units to, to take it. There's eight with a six shock general here. I definitely don't want to encourage him to invade me or attack me. So what we're going to do is leave um, 12 units. Warriors do not read books. Thankfully, no longer giving a negative stab hit, but and that's pretty shitty as well. 1517, which is unfortunately right after we're going to be taking the fucking tech. Damn you, you bastard. I kind of want to wait until that goes away. That's 10% is quite a chunky amount. It's like 60 something. Um, points. I don't, I don't like that at all. Uh, I sank a couple of the galleys. They're very nice. Oh, and you've just had a fucking noble rebellion? Fuck you. Don't rebel bomb me, you bastard. You just killed a lot of units, like 5,000 men. That was rude. Very rude indeed. Uh, let us drop you, and then you can go and repair in Rome, then you're going to join the uh, fleet I've got there, then we're going to blockade uh, Venice itself. Five galleys should be plenty at this point. Uh, the knights will probably just try and blockade until they peace out. The fact is, we're going to be sieging all of Venice, and Venice is not going to be able to... I mean, the knights aren't going to be able to stop me. So, I can kind of just do what I want. I don't need the knights to peace out before I peace Venice out. So, yeah, everything's going to go... Just swimmingly fine. Got plenty of ducats in the bank for a rainy day in case I need, you know, mercenaries if France decides to be a dick. Uh, so yeah, it's not going to be too bad. Unfortunately, Provence is being invaded by France right now, so we're probably going to be in a situation where uh, to get my core back in Avignon, um, I'm going to be, unfortunately, having to go to war with France again, which I don't want, because fighting France is a bitch. These guys are also building ships. A sack of Treviso. Oh, I didn't want to do that. I wanted to take the land for myself. Um, well, spend the 84 ducats to prevent the troops from being absolute assholes. And we'll get here at 99%. Let's, might as well wait the extra month.
gone. There it goes. Get you to blockade Venice itself. Lovely. What's this now? State firearm regiments. Never. I never take this because, I mean, why we don't want the maintenance to go up? That'd be, that'd be pretty stupid. The five galleys should, should be enough. Should be enough. Also, stop bloody uh, blockading me, you bastard. I mean, the thing is, he's blockading himself, not me. 20,000 troops should be enough. I mean, I've got a five uh, shock. He's only got a six only. Um, so we're just going to just gonna quickly murder you. Very nice. And I only need 3,000 men here, so take away the vast majority of my men here. Bring them back to Ferrara. Or actually bring them back to Rome. I've got how much seat? Two siege. That's decent. You can now take a diplomatic idea as well. We're uh, four years ahead of time. Would give me 20% extra tax, so I'm going to take it anyway. Plus, I don't want to take the tech immediately because of that fucking modifier. Although, then I would lose innovativeness, which is uh, not ideal. Let's get another claim on Naples. How's, how's the knights doing? They're not trying anything stupid. It doesn't look like it. If I wanted to peace out right now, I could. Uh, then we'd also want, obviously, war reps and some money. That's not a whole lot of money, actually, so I don't really care about it. Uh, just give me as much as you would. Seven ducats? Sounds fucking glorious. I don't need to siege them. I mean, what is what is really the point in sieging them at this point? Just take a land. Call it a day. Get the win. Get out of there. And get a claim on Venice for next time. No longer need that there. Now, I am the controller of the Straits to Venice. Very nice. You guys want to go and hunt pirates back in Genoa again? Still got that Roman Navy mission. Wish I could just turn this off for just this one. I think I think if I do that, it should be okay. We're at 43 spy network on the Mamluks now, which is gonna get us very close. You can go back to drilling, saving manpower ready for the war to come against Naples. Aggressive expansion, it's looking fairly rough. That's why I need these six years to just be chill time. Uh, you want military access? So war with France? Absolutely, you can have all the military access you desire, my dude. S. Galerie, Provence. Hopefully he leaves, like, just Toulon. Uh, and Ikes. I imagine it's... Quite a hefty amount of aggressive expansion to take on all of Provence. I hope. What's he gonna do? Come on, France. Make your play. Actually, he hasn't sieged uh, Lorraine and Metz yet, so... I guess he's got some things ahead of him. Uh, Naples have claimed on me, the bastards. Absolute scum. Kinda wish you didn't take free rule. I want that. I, I doubt we're gonna be... Oh, you shit fucks. Found my, found my dude. That's annoying. I have to do that again. Uh, oh yeah, we also need to claim... Sorry, core all the land we've just taken. Very nice. Venice is basically removed as a threat for the rest of the campaign. Uh, they were they were pretty threatening at the very start, but now they're irrelevant. Ooh. Milan is also at war. Who are you, who are you actually at war with? Provence, Cleves, Milan, and Bologna. That could be rough. Depending on uh, what he decides to take. I mean, he's got a straight shot to Milan. If he wants to be completely crazy, he would take the land. But that would definitely be a coalition that I would hopefully lead. Uh, morale of navies, improve... Oh yeah, improve relations. Absolutely, 100% of the time. Get that improve relations up so that my... Uh, uh, my aggressive expansion will go down faster. Seems like a bloody good idea. Also a bloody good idea, summon the diet again. So, we can do stability 3. Don't like that one. Apologies for the noise of the mouse again. Uh, Portugal's opinion of me goes up. Um, uh, it's not It's not too interesting at this time. Uh, have a shipyard in Rome for one base production in Rome. Sounds like a fucking great idea. Because uh, I wanted one anyway. I did say, I think it was in the last episode. That's not Rome. That's Rome. 
I did say in the last episode, I think, that I wasn't going to build this yet, just in case there was a mission for it. And, uh, well, there is. Also, that should be upgraded. And so should fit in. This probably should as well, but we're going to leave it, because I don't need it, need it very much. I'm trying to de-siege too long. Good for them. It's only one ducat. Yeah, let's embrace. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Yeah. Um, admin tech is... Uh, I'm probably going to lose a bit of innovativeness here, which is rough. I don't like losing innovativeness. Right, that's going to get built just fine. Is there anything else I really want to build? Not really. Verona does have a thing as well. Where are my merchants right now? We've got one in Alexandria, one in Valencia. Transferring trade to Genoa. I could collect in Genoa and collect in Venice. That might be more money. I'm not sure. Also, let's embargo Milan because he's a dickhead. Uh, issue embargo. And we're also rivaled with Tunis. We should embargo Tunis. We're probably being embargoed by Naples. We're not. Only by Provence. Ragusa is transferring their trade power to me, and they're all in trade zone that is completely irrelevant to me, so that's nice. France is currently sieging Bologna. Um, no, they're not. They're, they're, they're pieced out with Bologna. Provence is no longer a valid rival. That means Provence got wrecked, and yes, they took, they took it all, apart from the land up here. Well, that means I can now rival Naples and get that... Uh, by now we're going up a bit faster. Very nice. Well, that also means that I need to stop embargoing you. And start embargoing you, you boss. Oh, I've still got a truce. I'll do it eventually. Milan is now allied with Naples, which is probably a pretty good alliance for them. So I'm probably going to get Austria to help me in this war. Um, they're not going to be able to take anything. Maybe they can take, like, Bertha or Waldestadt. Or I might try and give that back to Switzerland. That could be a good idea. For sure. Yeah, that seems like a better idea. Now, to claim on you, I now need 40 spy network, which is a hefty amount, let's say. Um, five prestige or 10 devotion. Uh, let's get the 10 devotion and get back closer to 100. There we go. Very nice. And we can also purchase another ability. Have to infantry ratio or feudal de jour law and rest thing, blah, blah. Both are kind of useless. Uh, let's also remove the edicts now. Ooh, they've now got a, uh, a button for that. I wish they had a button for no edict. I wish no edict was D and then closing this was a different shortcut. That would be nice. Uh, D, no edict C. Uh, D, no edict C. Yeah. I like my hotkeys. And they've added so many really good ones as well, so I'm quite happy with that, but more is always better. There's no way I'm going to make you a, a vassal peacefully. I need to do it at war. Now that I don't have Provence as a target for that, so I don't know how I'm going to get you. All this land is now mine. I will make it a state, but I'm going to save the points for it right now. Uh, complete the estate agenda, expand the port infrastructure in Rome. Very nice. Very nice indeed. So it's going to take a while until I can do another agenda, but I really, really like these. I think they're fantastic. It's very immersive. I could also get rid of one of these. I can get rid of Rite of Council now because their loyalty is so high. I don't need to just yet, but I kind of want to. I'll probably revoke this one as well as soon as I can. 15, 19. This one I don't like as much. Oh wow, Diet Sound gives them influence and lasts quite a long time as well. Uh, Savoy wants military access. They're at war with all those dickheads. Probably because of Genoa. Yes, it is. I could attack Genoa, but I want to save my aggressive expansion for when I'm fighting Naples. Uh, Aragon probably wouldn't be in too much danger. I mean, Castile is a... Oh, I didn't break the alliance. Of course I didn't, because that was 100. But, oh, there's just... Aragon's in a bit of danger, let's put it that way. 
Uh, lose 10 prestige, lose 10 loyalty, or 9 peasants rise up in Ancona. Pretty easy, I'll just have the peasants rise up the hill after all. Take an idea. Morale of navies is good, but I need to take the tech. It's kind of essential, let's put it that way. Oh, uh, let's get another claim on Naples as well before he count catches my spy master. There we go. Wait until like the 1st of December. I think I've got enough time for that. Come on. There we go. Don't have time to get it to January. And the peasants have less morale than us anyway, so who gives a fuck. Lovely. Crushed. Uh, definitely gained the Diplo points. And, uh, you know, start drilling again. Why not? 4297 on the Mamluks. Come on, we're so close. I want this Prester John mission complete. Come on. Gooser, Gooser is over. I don't really care. Gooser is irrelevant. Interesting that they're not uh, doing this, transferring trade power anymore. Austria pay, pay subsidies to them. Oh, they're allied with them as well. I guess they're uh, they're trying to say sorry for me, you know, <laughs> sieging them or Austria sieging them. Lots of money in the bank. Ragus is no longer transferring trade. Makes sense. He's probably going to transfer it to bloody Austria now, isn't he? The bastard. Come on, Mamluks, don't catch him. Two more months, I think. No, one more month. One more month. Do not catch him on the final day. You bastard. Austria is again the emperor. Alright, Mamluks, I would like to steal your maps of the Horn of Africa, but I need to get a ship down there, don't I? No, I need to get a man down there into Egypt. Oh, that's actually going to be really fucking tough. Because you will not give me military access. Oh, fucking ass. If I get my ships down here, what can I then man maps of? I completely forgot about that. And I also really hate that. I need to have dudes here. Avignon is no longer a core. Fine. It's going to be pretty difficult to get them anyway. Alright, so if I steal maps from you right now, what can I get? Arabia? No. Arabian Sea? No. I mean, this is the Arabian Sea, isn't it? Fuck me. No, it's the Red Sea. But I guess that is part of the Arabian Sea. Uh... No, it's, it is the Red Sea. There he is, the Red Sea. No, the region. Yeah, region of Arabian Sea. That's really annoying, actually. Five view on Egypt. Arabia's irrelevant. Well, no, it's, it's not irrelevant, but I can't get vision on it. Okay, just six. 56 for Central Asia. Jesus. Five for Egypt. Horn of Africa, 65. If only I could get there. Honestly, without going to war with the Mamluks, there's kind of no way to do that, because he doesn't fucking like me enough. He's really close to liking me. Stand proven relations. I might, we might be able to do it. I'd also try and give, send him a gift. I'm going to need to build cog. Just a single cog. I can transport transport one guy, just I need to get him to land in Alexandria, and we'll be able to do it. Hopefully he doesn't catch my spy by then, because, I mean, his opinion of me is going down because of covert actions. But it's also going up by, point, uh, by five a month. Oh, military access. Yes, I will have that gladly. Thank you very much. I just don't have a cog yet. Come on. We're so close. We're so close. We're so close. You also need to uh, go back to hunting pirates in Genoa. We're so, so close. I know we're over time, but I really want to get this before we do we finish. If Mamluks find my dude, I'm going to be really annoyed. Come on, Cog. Build faster, you bastard. Build faster with speed five. There's nothing else that's more important than this right now. Come on. Get built. 26th of February. A couple of months. Here's the Augsburg. Don't care. Uh, we're losing innovativeness. Because that 10 fucking percent, isn't it? Absolute shit bastard. 
increase over to, uh, it doesn't actually say there. But it is true. Don't want to lose the innovativeness, it's pretty good. Alright, 26, there it is. I should have a cog. I guess I'll wait an extra day then. Get down to Alexandria. Actually, I don't need to go to Alexandria specifically. I just need to get into the Egypt zone. So Benghazi is enough. And we're also going to take the military tech now. Actually, it wasn't that thing only until 1517. Maybe I wasn't uh, fucking up there. All right, get there. Uh, da, 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 da. Yeah, I'll take that. It's fine. Right. Mamluks did not catch my guy. Steal the map. The Horn of Africa. 65 extra provinces. Vision on it all. Beautiful. Yes. Right, let's have a look. Are there any Christians? You are a Christian. Hello there, Kaffir. Let's improve relations with you. I'm, only, I'm not going to be able to get him all the way. I need to get him to 100. I only do 100. It's going to be the same for all of them, though, isn't it? Fuck. I mean, I, I, I could send him a gift to top it off afterwards. Uh, also, Latin Knights are now upgraded. So are you. You can be a Padero. It sounds more Italian. It sounds more Spanish, but eh, it's close enough. All right, you get back on the ships, and we're going to get you go to go back to Rome to re-drill and... Uh, yeah, everything's great. All right, so with uh, with that done, I am going to take a short break here. I hope you've enjoyed this episode. If you have, feel free to click the like button. Let me know your thoughts in the comments section below. Um, yeah, it's been uh, it's been a it's been a fun campaign so far. I hope you've enjoyed it too. Yeah. Uh, with all that said, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.